going on YouTube? My name is Jacob. Welcome to 911%, a channel where I bring you guys along on my many random adventures with my Porsche 911. So this 1997 Carrera 4S and uh, my newly acquired 2011 4S. I post videos on Thursdays, everything from driving to events, even a few technically oriented videos as well. So if that's something that interests you, hit the subscribe button, come hang out. So just a quick interruption here in this video. I uh, just wanna let you guys know that I'm heading to California to Rensport Reunion 6. So if you see me filming the event out there with the camera, make sure to pop by and say hello. Uh, let's chat, let's chat Porsches, show me something cool. And anyways, back to your regular schedule programming. Just wanna make that quick announcement. Today I'm getting nostalgic with the 993. We're going on an urban ride downtown Toronto, actually on the east end here, to one of my favorite coffee shops. I thought I'd take the 993 out because it really has been in the garage. Uh, with the coming of the 997, I've been really neglecting this car. It has 700 kilometers on the odometer for this year. <laughs> is a far more civil ride so anytime I'm going anywhere I just I want the AC on you know and all that stuff so of course as soon as I get behind the wheel it all comes back the fit of the seat the smell of the leather the noisy cabin the burble of the exhaust this car is super special and uh, i love it very much and actually if you're looking for more love on the 993 i made a video last year the five things i absolutely love about it i'm going to post it in the cards above so check that out or save it for later i'm just basically arrived at the coffee shop but there's this awesome view here that i wanted to show you guys and uh take a snap of the car because it's pretty sweet But it's a pretty cool view of the whole Toronto skyline. So, but anyway, I gotta get out of here. Grab this coffee. Let's do this. It's like mad hot in here. Whoa. It's not that my air conditioning doesn't work. I just don't like putting it on. All right, so now let's head over to a cool spot on the lake to film the car a little bit because not only is part of the nostalgia, the feel, but it's also the look of the car. So I love filming it, it's awesome. All right, so uh, I'll see you guys there.
yes, it's visceral and raw and it drives awesome and it sounds great, but let's not forget that it's also a thing of absolute beauty. Check this out. I'm uh, toying with the idea of bringing the car back to original over the rest of the season. So as soon as I removed that roll bar over the winter last year, I started to think about some of the other details that I added, like the solid transmission mount, the three-spoke steering wheel, the super low height. I'm thinking maybe uh, bringing it back to original. What do you guys think? What should I do? Comment below. Let me know your thoughts. So last time I filmed a video like this, I mentioned that I will be running a different set of wheels for this year, for this season. So I'm gonna reveal the new wheels in an upcoming video, so stay tuned for that. So obviously I'm still here on these BBS. It's a long, boring story, so whatever, I'm not gonna get into it. But I'm planning to run the new wheels sooner or later. It's just a matter of figuring out what's going on with the rubber situation. Do I buy new tires? Do I transfer these, these tires onto the, the wheels? Either way, when it goes down, I'll film it, and I'll make sure you guys get the full scoop. Also, I have a few uh, maintenance items piling up on the car that I want to take care of um, before storage. So I'll film those uh, if there are any DIY worthy stuff. So I'll definitely be making more videos, so stay tuned for those. The plans for the rest of the season are simple, try to get out for drives as much as I can with the boys. Everyone's lives are super busy lately, so it's been hard to coordinate uh, rides lately, but that's definitely in the cards before the snow falls in November. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it in a nutshell. Nothing new to report. Oh, by the way, guys, I sell these stickers, or will be soon, on the website. 911% Boutique Oil Queen, for your boutique oil queens. Uh, help support the channel, 911%.com. Get a t-shirt, get some stickers. It uh, helps me out, and uh, more content. More content for you guys, so. All right, so I think that's pretty much it. That covers the getting nostalgic episode. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe, comment, and like, and I'll see you guys next Thursday. Take care.